it was just unbelievable. I mean, something we never expect to see in our little community. Hear from people who knew the victims of a killing spree. Good evening. A community is in mourning tonight after a man killed three of his family members, then one after the other, two unsuspecting strangers he encountered while on the run. News 13's Jose Mitri spoke with some of the victim's family. Jessica, not only did the suspect's family lose loved ones, but investigators say his teenage sister witnessed the deadly shootings before running for help. Yeah, never imagined it. Never imagined anything like that. Connie and Jimmy Ortega live across the street from the first deadly shooting scene in La Madera. Breaks your heart. And that's how we are heartbroken now. They were among the first to hear what happened yesterday afternoon. I heard the shots, but I didn't go out. Then she heard banging on the door. She just said, I, I need help. She told me my brother killed Brendan, my mom and Max, they're dead. They called 911, reporting 21-year-old Damien Herrera as the killer. Investigators say Damien used his stepfather, Max Trujillo's own gun, to kill him outside his home. I believe there was a dispute between his stepfather and he about the use of the stepfather's vehicle to go to an appointment. They say when Damien's brother, 20-year-old Brendan, stepped in to fight him for the gun, Damien killed him and then killed his mother, all according to his teenage sister, who ran to the Ortegas afterward. Just crying and, and yelling, and, and it, it, was, it was bad. Damien, however, appeared unemotional in court today. You can face life in prison. You understand that? Yeah. He's accused of killing Michael Kite in Tres Piedras, taking his truck when Damien's ran out of gas, then killing Manuel Serrano at an Abiquiu gas station. I don't know. It just, something snapped, and we don't know what it was. He says Max was a welder, Brenda always a helpful person, and the same for Brendan. He'd come and, you know, uh, no, you don't have to pay me, you know, he was that, that type, of a, type of a guy. The community has organized a candlelight vigil tomorrow night at La Morada Chapel in La Madera. Back to you. All right, thank you, Jose. A criminal complaint says Damien had told family before that he intended to kill or hurt people for fun. Deputies say he confessed to the killings, but not before trying to fight a deputy for his gun when he was arrested. He has no criminal history.